I've made a couple of videos about TikTok and how I hate it. Well, newsflash, I don't hate it. I love it a lot and I'm extremely well versed in TikTok now at this point. Lil Shardy the baddest. Bad. Bleep. Bleep. Uh, Addison Ray. Addison Lashani Ray. The baddest. Yeah. So these lyrics are obviously very heartfelt to me. I came across this YouTube channel called. Let's look it up. Little Shardy the Baddest. As a Ray, as you guys know, every video I make, I dedicate it to a different cause or organization that goes to help black lives. This week's video is dedicated to the Black AIDS Institute. Their mission is to stop the AIDS epidemic in black communities by engaging and mobilizing black institutions and individuals in efforts to confront HIV. In the description below, I'm going to leave a link where you can go and donate to the Black AIDS Institute and help out this cause. So without further ado, let's get into the video. I found this channel called Brat TV, which is basically like a network for people to act on on YouTube. It has 4.5 million subscribers. Brat TV has a lot of like local LA kid actors, I think. That's what I've sort of figured in my head. And then some of them are actually TikTok stars, your favorite TikTok stars. This video is called Attaway General. It has six over 6 million views and I really wanted to watch and review this so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and just watch this because I'm, I'm kind of dying to know it's only nine minutes I don't even know what I'm looking at today's premiere of Attaway General is brought to you by Just Dance 2020 Brother, sisters, <laughs> this game is honestly <laughs> so much fun So what I'm getting from the first like two seconds is it's a town called Attaway in general as in emergency like general hospital. I got it. I got it. I got it. The teen volunteer or TV program is what you make of it. The more you prove yourself, the more rewarding your time will be. We only get to observe in the ER. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I watched that whole thing and I did not catch anything of what she was saying. <laughs> We're gonna rewind that and try again. The teen volunteer or TV program is what you make of it. The more you prove yourself, the more rewarding your time will be. We only get to observe in the ER. The ER is usually reserved for third year TVs. As first year TVs, you guys will be on pediatrics. Oh, I see. It's like a. <laughs> it's like Grey's Anatomy. Look at that oh. face. I'm assuming this is the general doctor. The general. You'll help with cleric work, transpo, keeping patients company. Yes. Babysitting. Great. That's right, Georgia. Make them feel seen, heard, comforted, whatever they need. What is she looking at? Got a problem with that? Get an MD. Any questions? She said, got a problem with that? Get an MD. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> Ambulance bay needs hands. Patient Dr. Henry and everyone on call. Metro bus crash downtown. We're about to be at capacity. What can we do? Nothing. Maeve. This is Maeve. She's our top second year. She's gonna finish the tour while I go home. <laughs> oh, this is gonna suck. This is gonna be amazing. Okay, I literally can pinpoint every single one of these characters that they're basing off of Grey's Anatomy. Okay, so this girl right here is... What's her name? Shit, I forgot. Sandra O. Oh. This guy right here is... What's his name? <laughs> Hold on. Obviously, Dixie is the Miranda Gray. Or no, Miranda Miranda. <laughs> God, I used to watch Grey's Anatomy all the time. Alex Karev as this curly boy right here. Christina Yang as this girl right here. Obviously, Dixie is Meredith Gray, and everyone else is in the background. Yo. Okay, this intro though, I'm getting <laughs> like a house. This is like house for teens. <laughs> well, I can see why they call this room the shed. Come on, the faster we finish, the faster we can go do something real. We've been here five seconds. Studies show we form lasting impressions about others within seconds of meeting. So I can't be with you in a closet when I meet Dr. Henry. 
He's the most brilliant surgeon in the state. Unfortunately, he doesn't have the same accolades as a father. Seriously? You're his daughter? You're so lucky you don't even know it. So Dixie is playing a girl whose father is the head surgery doctor. She's like the cool like, you know, rolling her eyes like, oh yeah, my dad's a surgeon. Why am I here? Wee, wee, wee. You're giving me the impression I don't want to be in the same room as you. Well, that's mutual. If you're so advanced, why don't you go scrub in? Leave me be. Maybe I will. She doesn't care. Trey Chic, she doesn't care. <laughs> it's like a lot is going on, but also nothing is going on. It's like a lot of blah, 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 but like nothing is really happening, you know? Hello? Hey, do you work here? Sure do. What do you need? Uh, my doctor, she took me back here forever ago and she hasn't come back yet. Sorry, but it's really busy right now. There's been a huge accident. I know, I was in it. You should be fine to wait a little. If you hit an artery, you would have passed out by now. Thanks. I'm holding. Kit. I see. I see something happening right now. This is like, what's that storyline of Izzy and that guy who had the heart problem in Grey's Anatomy and they like fell in love and got married when he was dying. This is it. Dude, like the parallels. My film brain is like just going crazy. Oh. He's definitely on TikTok. Um, also, is that a doll? <laughs> I think that's an American Girl doll, so. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh. Don't come any closer. I don't think that's gonna hurt anyone. <laughs> so, Miss Dixie fell asleep. Oh, the way she got up. <laughs> What are you doing? Oh. Don't come any closer. I don't think that's gonna hurt anyone. Depends where I put it. <gasps> Your new TV. <laughs> Your new TV, aren't you? Nicely done, Sherlock. What, what the fuck did he? What the? What did he say? Your new TV? Your new TV, aren't you? Your new TV on you? What? Your new TV on you? I have no idea what he says. I'm about to put the captions on. Your new TV on you. What does that even mean? Oh my god. Do you always sneak up on people when they're sleeping? Actually, I had a reason to be in here. Some of us have work. Am I supposed to congratulate you? If you want to. <gasps> you, come here. It's our first day. Get over here, come on. Grab on, right below the elbow and squeeze as tight as you can. Now don't worry about hurting her. Good, minute longer. And we're in. I'm pretty sure this is a mechanical pencil. <laughs> oh, it's not even going in. Keep up the rescue breaths. Good job. Kit. Kit, I'm Dr. Henry. I know, you're amazing. I read your book. She saved a life on her first day. The adrenaline was amazing. So first I stuck into the ER and there was this boy, he was bleeding everywhere. So I saved his life. <sighs> While you guys are patting yourselves on the back, your patients are still in critical condition. Don't ever forget why you're here. Should we watch a second episode? This is episode two called Kit Checks In on Holden. I still don't know anybody's names and I still don't really know what's going on. I did not sign up for a volunteer janitor program. No offense. Busboy, why are you back here? Just waiting to get my stitches removed. Mind if I take a look? I don't, these kids have no, it, they're not doctors. We should say, I'm gonna, let me take, can I take a look? Like the girl in the beginning said, get an MD. <laughs> Sutures look like they healed nicely. Shouldn't have too much of a scar. Okay, now come on. What does she know? I'm gonna be honest. What, what does she know about being about, about, about stitches? I would have used absorbable sutures myself, but then they couldn't bill you twice. I gotta go. Oh no! Oh! <laughs> I think it's like so dramatic, but then also not dramatic enough. Like it's really dramatic 
in the times when it's not supposed to be that dramatic and then like just a lack of drama when it's like supposed to be hyped up. Um, like I said, welcome to the library where I'm reading everybody on their acting skills when I have none. Ooh, that's Dr. Henry Sergio protege. I would love to pick his brain. Bye. <laughs> we meet again. Must be fate or a small hospital. Where are you headed? I was on my way to the supply room for supplies. That's funny. So was I. Oh, that was like the most, un like for two people who are dating, that was so, I know like, you know, tensions are high when you're on the set and all that stuff, but we meet again. <laughs> I didn't know you were Dr. Henry's protege. What a nerd. Nerd or stud? Smart is the new sexy. I read that somewhere. Oh, you read too? I'm impressed. I read lots of things. Novels, magazines, instruction manuals. So Miss Dixie's playing hard to get. Mm, okay. I'm so sorry you're hurting. How about an ice pack for that eye? No, I'm good. Can I get you some pudding? Juice? Just juice? Just juice, please. Uh, don't mind him. Be a little bit nicer. Poor kid's been through enough. This poor girl right here. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay, now you are definitely staring. Uh, I forgot I told Nina to get something from the shed. You really don't know where the bandages are? Oh, I do. I just needed an excuse to get you in here. You don't even excuse. <laughs> Holden? What's going on? Get back. Sometimes I don't want to be a bay. If you hadn't snitched, I'd still be on the lacrosse team. I should have hit you harder. Hey, hey, enough. Snitch on me again, and I will break your jaw a second time. You do that, and you have to deal with me. All right. <laughs> it says teen volunteer on their shirt. I thought these were teens playing adults. You see, this is why I get so lost. Like, it's just I, the marks get missed in these teen dramas. Hey, I've been looking for you. Here I am. You know, I was a TV too. All four years of high school. So? So, I didn't want to be here either. I messed up and this was my punishment. Well, why are you still hanging around? Because I made the best of it. I could have shut down, ran out, and gone down a really bad path. But the patients needed me, and the doctors trusted me. Bye. Okay, out of all the TikTokers, she might be the best actor. I'm not sure, though. Are these all TikTokers? I don't know. Ready? Yeah. Staying out of trouble, I hope. Of course. You know me, Dad. That's her dad? How in the hell? All right, well, that's all of the Adway General we're gonna be watching for this video. If you want me to continue this series, please leave it down below in the comments and let me know who your favorite TikTok actor is. Um, and if I should audition to be an, act to be an actress. That's all I wanted to do. <laughs> Uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> Make sure to donate to the Black AIDS Institute and take care, everybody. I'll see you next time. No, I don't like that. I never know how to end my videos. Peace. Love. Bye. <laughs>